Hi, I'm Karen Hummel, and I'm your child science teacher this year. Um, everybody but two kids in the class I also have for math. I'll show my screen. I know that the kids all picked up two books and we're gonna, I'll show you those and then the ones that we will have after that. So let me just share my screen real quickly. And while I'm doing that, just, let, just to let you know that I am very passionate about teaching and I love it so much. And now my oldest daughter, uh, she's uh, 26 and she is now teaching second grade at Lake Ridge. So it's so fun to have a Miss Hummel and a Mrs. Hummel in the same district. Okay, this is the book that the kids are in right now. It's called Science and Technology. Um, they have the paperback and it's just like mine and there are um, lots of places in there as we discuss that they should be writing down um, things and that you know are the answers to some of the questions in there. So this week I'll show them more closely what that looks like and what they should be um, writing down so that they can remember it. Okay, so then the next one is um, Ecology and the Environment. They also picked this one up. So it'll be the second book. Just to know that um, we don't go over every chapter in each book. So it's different, whatever book it is, whatever we need to cover for the standards and everything. So we don't go through every chapter but I always encourage the kids to go ahead and read it. There's a lot of um, interesting things in there. All right, so after that, the next book is Forces and Energy. This one is the, one of the biggest ones um, that the kids don't have it yet, but it is at school. So if we continue with online learning, there'll be another time for the kids to be able to pick this book up and then the last one, which is um, Sound and Light. So those are the four textbooks that we have. Okay. Um, I'm going to stop my share now. So thank you for your patience there. Um, so anyway, hopefully the kids have been enjoying their science learning um, so far. It's just a little harder being online because when we have a lot of equipment in the class and you know, could do more hands-on things. Um, but we'll try to spice it up a little bit because I know it's hard and that's, that's the fun part of being in uh, science, right? The discovery. So anyway, just a reminder about um, the subjects and that they will probably again have uh, three assignments that they need to turn in each week. So have them check their um, folder inside, you know, the class each week. The um, folders will be the same color. You know, this next week is orange for math and for science. And um, then all of their assignments will be under there. It's just, it takes a while to get used to the system, but I think they're doing pretty well. So anyway, um, the science team puts together a lot of the ideas for uh, the science activities that we'll be doing. Um, and then we share a lot of that together. So it's really a team effort. And know that your child's not going to be getting um, a an experience that's totally different than the other sixth graders, okay, because we do work as a team. So anyway, if you have any questions or concerns, feel free to email me. Like I said, I gave you a lot of the inf other information about Schoology and Skyward in the math video. So um, this one is just about science, and I just wanted to share with you what we'll be learning this year, and hopefully it's going to be a fun time for the kids. All right, so let me know if you ever have any uh, questions or concerns. I'm here for you. Okay.